Good morning, good morning. We're in a forensic tool. Good morning, everybody. Wake up, grab a coffee. I don't know what we're looking at here. Uh, Barbara, a new a new member on our channel, said, Chris, can I post stuff on your channel? So I said, okay, I'll do you one better. I'll do forensic on this one. So <clears throat> I'm going to show you the magnifier right here. I also have, uh, let me see if I can pull it up, if I remember how. <laughs> Okay, I do remember how. Anyways, I got my little tool and we're going to play with it. Right now, we're going to look at the magnifier. Okay, so we're magnifying this bottom one. And now you remember this, I, I did like, um, it's 21,000 pixels, so it's like 4K. Um, I brought it up to 4k so you could really see this this object here um, it's really strange looking but it's putting out a lot of smoke now notice how they're putting out a lot of smoke each one of them see up here see how it's putting out a lot of smoke and I'm gonna show you that each one of these is a different entity like right here this is one of a uh, I seen on YouTube one of our planes this Y shaped one and then you have this other one that's more of a triangle which, you know, the Black Mantis, you know. And this one, I don't know. This could be that wide V-shaped ship they see in over Arizona. But are they spreading some kind of chemtrails? Are they releasing something in the atmosphere? Let me show you. We're on Magnification 8. I'm going to do Auto Contrast by Channel, which will separate the actual colors in the ship. Okay, like the smoke. You see the difference in the color? And it's reflection off the sun, too. One of the things I did do um, was I mentioned that I took away the telephone lines. And I'll show you that, how I could detect when stuff's manipulated in a picture. Okay, so let me just go to that. I want to show you guys how, if you put up someone else's picture and it has CGI in it, well, let me show you how I could tell. See, the three telephone lines are right here. Right there, you see that? Now, the only thing I might have lost was right there. So let's go back to the magnifier and go right there. I didn't lose it. See that? Something there. I didn't lose that object. And then you got these two, I would say, planes hovering or crossing. But you see the black line on top? <clears throat> some reason I'm thinking that's some something black they're putting out. Some kind of um, field that makes them invisible. But in this case, it wasn't too invisible. I don't know. Down here, same thing, you got this black covering stuff. And over here, the same thing. Now, I don't know if it's part of the ship, but let's go to this other tool I got. If I go by uh, histogram, it's going to use like light waves and whatnot. You're going to see the atmosphere has changed around each ship. See, this is what, what are they pouring out here? See the dark purple? It's detecting chemicals. A different array of chemicals being mixed. Now, I don't know where this is over. I don't know what state. But when I see stuff like this, I take authority over it. And bind it in the name of Jesus. I stop all activity of this kind. Because they're obviously spraying some chemical in the air. So I think these are all government released. Even this thing, as weird as it is. Now I have another tool on here. Are you guys following? It's called... Luminous Grantus, and I, I showed you the phone lines I removed, so it removed part of. Now, if these were fake, they'd be something different about them, like this, under this tool. But they're not fake. See, they're real. And let me show you. This is pretty uh, intense, this little tool. They were the phone lines. Now, just to prove to you that I removed the phone lines, I'm going to show you this picture right there. Let me see if I could just, instead of pulling it in, let me open it. Okay, those are the original phone lines, you see guys? I took the phone lines out. <clears throat> it didn't matter um, to record them, so I took them out. Let me go back, go back to the original. You see the original is right here. Let's go to the original phone lines. But see, the original, you're not going to see. I'm going to go auto contrast. You see them. 
you can see them. It's the original picture. So I can detect if you're if you're doing CGI trying to fool our channel. I don't think Barbara is, and I'm not a debunker, so I would never embarrass anybody, but I really want to get down to this smoke. So I'm going to go back to that 5K picture, okay? Um, and I always sign my pictures with a frame now. I don't put my name in them because they're your pictures that you caught, and you, I want to give you a chance to sign them. I'll show them because I did the filtering in the frame, but this is what I want to show right there. That is some kind of... The object coming down on the bottom, I don't know if that's smoke or if that's some kind of like tail from this thing. But you don't know what the government has created. They don't, you know, always speak the truth. You guys watch CNN know that. Or NBC. Even Fox, they don't tell the truth. Newsmax is pretty close to what Fox used to be, but I think it's all a game. I think Murdoch or whoever this guy is, this Arabian guy. Arabian guy. I think he owns it all. I want to know what the smoke is. So let me show you this tool. <clears throat> You'll like it. It's called the sweep. And what it does, it pulls out the energy sources, you see? Now the sweep, I can, you know, pull out that smoke too as a light source. Let's do that. Okay, you see, obviously, there's some black smoke right there. Or there's some kind of a extension of that ship right there it's just a little bit different see how that's a triangle more like a black mantis and this one's like the triangle type this down here is something uh, putting out all that smoke you see that and this up here but that blocked why I don't know it's blocked maybe it has a signet and they're blocking it through CGI I don't know Remember, um, she caught this with her camera, so she's not doing the CGI. If anybody did CGI, I took the phone lines out. But there's an object right there just pouring smoke out. Alright, that's my take on it because I got this tool. Now here's the power sources on each vehicle. They each have a lot of power going. These, these are the United States uh, created, like Manus and whatever you want to call that one. Uh, there's a name for it. <clears throat> I've been looking at YouTube quite a bit. I just don't remember the names for it. This object's got me boggled. Puzzled. And I say, what are they pouring out of the back of these ships? What kind of chemicals are they introducing to our atmosphere? I don't know. I'm just talking. I'm speculating. Because, I mean, you could obviously see the proof. The proof is in the pudding. Look at all that smoke. Now, if these are anti-gravity type machines that they're showing... They don't put out smoke. They use electromagnetic forces and <clears throat> anti-gravity machines. I mean, you guys do your own research on UAPs and stuff. They're very real and they're very demonic, if you ask me. Aliens equal to me, the demons. Um, Anunnaki, Anunnaki, or Rephemims, or Nephiliums, all fallen angels. It's just a 21st century version if you do see a UFO, and I got pictures. I'll show you your UFO. Okay, I got another tool. That's this level sweep tool. I love it. I love it. Let's see if I could give it a whole different look. See, that's opacity. Turn it all the way down. The width, I turn it all the way up. And then the sweep, I could little by little, with the opacity, begin to show you just different views of this thing I try not to make these I can get carried away and sit here for an hour so I try not to do that I think that black stuff on top is an object I think that that thing is an object and I think this is the cloaking devices of these two ships from us I, I'm going to say they're all from us okay let's go back to the magnifier look at them one more time under enhanced Auto contrast by channel, it separates the colors for different things. There's number one with its smoke. It's got color in the smoke because it's got chemicals in the smoke. And you guys can go learn about that. These devices that I'm using right here pick up everything. And you can see it's the same type of purplish smoke. And this one's pouring out something right there. It comes down this other object right there in the center. And that object is actually 
pouring out smoke. So if that's another, I don't know, might be a drone doing it. I'm just using my imagination and I watch the History Channel and I watch, you know, I watch stuff on YouTube that shows you different aspects of things and you could see. So there you go. I proved these three things are doing some kind of chemical warfare, maybe. Warfare, yeah. On the Americans, on the foreigners, on the immigrants. Anyways, it's up to you to comment and say, you know, what you think it is, but now you guys know what noise is. See this? The noise reveals that something happened to the page that wasn't normal. I erased phone lines. But these objects, I didn't erase. You could see that they're real, just like how I erased the surface of the picture. They, they're doing con constructs. Like, you can see the constructs. You can see the activity around them. Um, right here, where I keep being suspicious. You know, there's something there, right there, right in there. So, just so you know, something really there, causing some kind of smoke. And up here, you see the dark out area? That's something there. Something there. So, you can see with your eyes or without your eyes, the advantage of this forensic tool is, and I will not give the name away, I was going to give it away like two months ago, I put it out there, nobody even responded to it, but people do want this tool, this forensic tool. You see that black square, and now you can see it's like an octagon. Like UFC fighters have the octagon they fight in, that's an octagon. Oxygon over. All right, that's enough of that. You guys have a great day. They're my UAPs for the month. Thank you, Barbara. You guys go visit her channel, all right? I'll talk to you later. God bless.